नमस्कार माई सेल्फ उमा शंकर दास वेलकम टू द वीकली वेदर ब्रीफिंग ऑफ इंडिया मेट्रोलॉजिकल डिपार्टमेंट वी विल फास्ट डिस्कस अबाउट द पास्ट सेवन डेज वेदर हाईलाइट्स एज वेल एज ए वेदर सिस्टम दैट ए रिजल्ट दिज एक्सेप्शनली और एक्सट्रीमली हैवी रेनफॉल एक्टिविटी पर्टिकुलरली इफ यू सी द ओवरऑल एक्टिव मानसून कंडीशन प्रिवेल ओवर द नॉर्थ वेस्ट एज वेल एज सेंट्रल इंडिया ड्यूरिंग द वीक Apart from that, the weekly cumulative rainfall over the most parts of the uh, meteorological subdivision over these parts, particularly, uh, are above normal. And for if you look at the country as a whole, it is 48 percent above normal comparison to its long period average. Apart from that, exceptional heavy rainfall during the week was observed over Kamaradi of Telangana uh, subdivision. That is, rainfall was amounting around 41 centimeter. That is on 28th August. Extremely heavy rainfall, uh, particularly observed. over telangana on 28th 29th august and 1st september in konkan goa on 28th august if you talk about the coastal karnataka marathawada also ex- extremely heavy rainfall was observed on 29th august tamil nadu puducherry on 31st august apart from that uh, the northwest india and some parts of western himalaya region particularly himalachal pradesh uttarakhand punjab west rajasthan uh, extremely heavy rainfall was observed on 1st september and over west उत्तर प्रदेश एंड उड़ीसा ऑन सेकेंड सेप्टेम्बर एगेन ओवर जम्मू काश्मीर ऑन थर्ड सेप्टेम्बर एक्सट्रीमली हेवी रेनफॉल वाज ऑब्जर्व इफ यू टॉक अबाउट द वेदर बिहाइंड दिस एक्टिव कंडीशन पर्टिकुलरली एक्टिव टू भिगर एस मॉनसून कंडीशन विथ हेवी टू वेरी हेवी रेनफॉल स्पेल ऑब्जर्व ड्यूरिंग द वीक ड्यू टू इंटरेक्शन ऑफ साउथ सदरली एंड साउथ ईस्टर्ली लोअर लेवल विथ मॉइस्चर लेडिंग विंडस विथ द स्टेशनरी वेस्टर्न डिस्टर्बेंस दैट इज परसिस्टेंट ओवर नॉर्थ Pakistan adjoining uh, Punjab and uh, Jammu Kashmir region for during the period 28 to 3rd August and the interaction of these uh, due to these events they produce extremely heavy rainfall events over particularly Himalaya western Himalaya region apart from that last week's well mark low pressure area uh, that is weakened into a low pressure area on 28th uh, of August that is over south odisha adjoining uh, Chhattisgarh apart from that which is became less mark on 29th over the same region and another formation of another fresh low pressure area over northwest bengal was observed on 2nd of september which become more mark on 3rd september over the same region if you talk about during the weather highlight particularly a cloud burst event was recorded over monlali area of uh, tamil nadu as well as over the chennai during night of 30th august 2025 especially during the period 10 more night Uh, 10 pm and uh, 12 uh, pm where the extremely heavy rainfall was observed during this period if you talk about the past week rainfall over the different sub region particularly east and northeast india uh, reported 46.1 mm rainfall which is about 29% of its long period average that is below normal activity was observed over this east and northeast india during the week however northwest india result a uh, large excess rainfall which is around 182% from its uh, long period average rainfall that is th- uh, it is reported uh, recorded 95.9 mm uh, compared to its normal value of 34 mm in central india it is 11% higher south peninsula 73% country as a whole if you talk about the during the week that is 28th august to 3rd september it is 48% above during this week if you talk about the seasonal rainfall particularly east and northeast india is below normal by 18% northwest india is above normal by 36% central india 9% south peninsula 10% but country as a whole from 1st june to 3rd september it is around 8% so total rainfall over the country as a whole is reported 780.8 mm comparison to its normal value of 721.1 mm if you talk about the next two weeks Uh, forecast particularly this uh, during the week 1 that is 4th to 10th september overall rainfall activity likely to be above normal over the some parts of northwest india gujarat region near normal over central east and northeast india and below normal over most parts of the southern peninsula particularly we are anticipating uh, that uh, there will be extremely heavy rainfall that is rainfall more than 
21 or more than 21 centimeter is expected over Gujarat region during till 6th of September and particularly over Saurashtra Gauch we are anticipating rainfall activity will be 21 or more centimeter during during 6th and 7th of September and during the week 2 the overall rainfall activity likely to be normal to abnormal over east northeast India near normal over central south peninsular India and below normal over most parts of northeast India during the week 2 that is 11th to 17th September. If you talk about the particularly some parts of eastern pockets like Bihar, Jharkhand likely to get isolated heavy rainfall activity apart from that northeastern states likely to get Assam, Meghala likely to get isolated heavy and some parts of Tamil Nadu heavy rainfall possibility also uh, is there during the week 2. If you talk about the forecast of cyclone generation during next two weeks, particularly the existing low pressure area that is over uh, currently lying over northeast Madhya Pradesh, which will re-intensify into a well-marked low pressure area over South Rajasthan and adjoining North Gujarat uh, during the middle of the week one, and uh, there is also low probability of its further intensification into a depression over Gujarat and Mavarud. Apart from that, there is likely to hood of formation of another an upper air cyclonic circulation Gangetic West Bengal and neighborhood during the week 1 around 8 September and possibility of uh, formation of a uh, low pressure area over Bay Bengal region, particularly northwest Bay Bengal region around 13th of September. You can follow us in different uh, social media platforms, different app you can also follow us also you can connect to us regularly with our daily weather briefing as well as morning weather briefing. Thank you. Namaskar.